Hello, YouTube. Welcome back, Knuckleheads. Um, fuck off. And welcome back to another episode of Midget Games. And we are here with Wormus again. And um, I kind of wanted to make this a topic episode this week. Um, but we'll go ahead and get right into the game. And this episode, holy shit, my guy's glitching. Is uh, we're going to talk about what just happened in the last day or so. Which was uh, Keemstar versus Leafy again. Um, so just so you guys, you guys know, if you didn't notice, um, about a couple days ago, um, I believe Saturday, no Friday, um, uh, Drama Alert had reported that uh, Leafy was somebody. And then, um, basically what had happened afterwards is, um, um, there was a little bit of an issue, uh, Scarce came in, um, and kind of clarified the situation that it was, there was an ability to, um, sub-bot <coughs> in the game, or on the webpage that, um, was supposedly where the, uh, sub and stuff was. Um, there was a... It basically, Leafy was accused of subbotting, and it was basically proven. Basically, I would say without a doubt. I mean, it's ninety percent certainty that he did not subbot. Um, you could expect Element the page, and basically superimpose Leafy's information and clickable information on it. And this was originally um, acute. The accusation was originally um, from Etsy. He's like a hundred thousand sub guy, so yeah, got you. And so with that, um, it was kind of interesting. Um, but basically, what happened is, as he accused him, Drama Alert ran with it. Um, Scarce actually went in. Ooh, damn. And basically, uh. <coughs> Scarce had found out about the inspect element and basically it said, hey, this isn't right, you know, the, informa the information's not out there correctly. And then, I guess, um, <coughs> what happened was, uh, uh, Keemstar and Scarce got into it, um, over on his stream on... I don't know what he streams on. I can't do Twitch, but um, hello. I hate when people call me. That was annoying. Anyway, so, um, going back into the story here. So, Scarce and, um, Keemstar got into it a little bit on his stream. And, uh, basically had, you know, got into a little bit of a pissy match between the two. And he uploaded it, part two. Um, and it's not Scarce's fault. I don't think his words were taken out of context, per se. Uh, Keemstar had made the accusation that, um, Keem, or Scarce had said that it, this was making it proven false. Um, where it was just, uh, yeah. I mean, if you can expect the element of page and photo impose it, and the guy even says he was sorry later, it, it's pretty damning evidence that he faked it. But, well, I mean, who knows? I'm not gonna judge there. But, so anyways... That was that. Scarce, I guess, basically apologized in a way. I don't know how he. <laughs> I don't even think Scarce had to apologize, honestly. I think Scarce was doing his job and Keemstar didn't like it. Um. <clears throat> what? Um. So, anyways. <laughs> Uh, then, uh, Leafy, I guess, got into it with, uh, Keemstar, and the tweets started flying about Saturday day slash night, give or take, and they're quite hilarious, to be honest. Um, 
midlife, uh, there was a, uh, um, um, let me check one of these tweets here. Uh, so, from Keemstar, you're not scary, you're just a proven liar at Leafy is here. You're, th uh, Leafy goes, you're a 34 year old man that reads tweets for a living at Keemstar. And he changed his name to uh, Leafy LeafyBot7727. Not arguing with you on Twitter. Go have a meltdown somewhere else. Keemstar goes, You came on my show four times for interviews at Leafy is here, and then you exposed for body and you talk shit about it. Fake bitch. Um, oh my god, there's so many good ones. And then. <coughs> Thanks for all the support and rant video today. Love you fuckers. I'm going to sleep now at night. You're having a mid-puberty crisis at Leafy is here trolling 16. Uh, Keemstar goes, nice one, Keem. This 35-year-old got jokes. Um, hashtag Leafy email leaks. I mean, some of these are fucking hilarious. It, it, it's amazing. Um, uh... Basically, what the amount of bullshit there is in this game is, or in those tweets, and how they're just being children to each other. Um, everyone's like, yada yada this, <coughs> defamation that, bullshit, yeah, yeah whatever. Yeah, there we go, that's good enough for me. And it's just hilarious, like, I have never seen two grown-ass adults go at each other like this. It's just... Ah! But, I, I mean... There's all kinds of other things. Just... I, I, I don't get Keemstar. This is one of those times where I know he's the host of Drama Alert, and I know that he technically does not own the channel. Yada yada bullshit, whatever. He's just using it to get around YouTube shit. But even he should have known to not piss with Leafy. Like, this was one of those things, okay. You really should have let Scarce talk about it and just leave it to him or the other YouTube channels because now he put himself in a bad position where he's going to get hate again. I don't think he'll lose as, as many as subs as he did last time, but um, he knows how to just go and piss people off and it's just hilarious because, um, you know, Leafy and Grade had started to basically a pissing match war between him and uh, between those two and Keemstar and that doesn't look good for him ah, try to get cut him off but I mean I get it I, I mean his job is to quote unquote report the YouTube news I get it I, I don't blame Keem but this is kind of one of those topics, I mean, if I were him, I would have avoided it at all costs. Because, I mean, look at his dislikes. His his dislikes, last time I checked on it, it was like about even or the dislikes were higher. And it was just kind of interesting how, ooh. Eh. Oh, come on, that was my side. Bullshit. Um... But he, he, he needs to stop picking those fights. He just needs to. There's no reason. It, 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 it drives me nuts. It just... You know, I don't watch Leafy's content. I'm. It's just not my content to watch. Um, Leafy fans are... Fine as I'm aware of. I haven't met any bad Leafy fans, so... Um, I guess credit to you guys, because usually... It, if I hear something, it's, uh, I mean, usually if I hear anything bad, it's from Keemstar. Um, nothing against Keem, but that's what I always hear 
as far as information. So. Um, it'll be interesting to see um, where it goes from there, really. I mean, to be honest, I don't know if they're going to start continuing to spat some more or not. Um, it'd be interesting to see what Grade says. I'm gonna, I'll check out Grade in a bit and see if he's got anything to say about it. Because him and uh, Leafy were pretty close during the pissing match between those two and uh, Keemstar. So it might be interesting to check him out see what he's been up to <laughs> but that's really about what I have for that topic I mean all the information my opinion on this I think Keemstar is an idiot um, not in his content his content's fine but he should have not have started that pissing match with Leafy again there's no reason he should have started that pissing match there, there really isn't he, he should have just left it the fuck alone and let someone else report it and he would have been okay. But instead he had to go report the news because that's K K K Keemstar and Keemstar is just his shit. You know, whatever. Ooh. Ah, yes. Ah ha ha. Ooh. Oh my god, I'm getting big. I'm getting big. I'm number six. I'm number six. Ah. Um. I guess I'll keep going. <laughs> ah. Yeah. Yeah. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ah. Da 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 da. Whoop. Um, but yeah. Otherwise, I mean, the drama stuff, I mean, I, I try to stick my nose out of it if I can. That's my deal. Um, I like watching it, don't get me wrong. I mean, hell, fuck, I'll, t I'll watch it any day of the week. I just think it's hilarious that, um, Keemstar gets his ass in trouble all the time. I, I'm waiting to see if he gets his channel somehow taken away from him again. I mean, here, here's the thing with Kim, sorry. He, he eventually runs into a wall. And eventually he'll hit another wall and he'll lose his channel again. He does not understand when to shut the fuck up, basically. Uh, I got taken out. So, alrighty, guys. Well, that's it for uh, Wormus. Um, that's it for the topics of Keemstar and Leafy. Um, I, I really don't know what to say about those two guys. Um, have at it. I'll, I'll watch your drama while I am eating my popcorn. Have fun. Bye. Hey guys, I'm tagging this on to the end of the video here, um, but I guess it, <laughs> there was more shit that happened after I recorded this episode. Um, so I guess what happened was Leafy ended up posting a rant video about, um, well, you know it, Keemstar, and um, he says he might end up suing Keemstar for uh, defamation. I uh, don't know if I'll win that case or not, but um, he's got a bunch of lawyers that says he can win, so... Um, more power to Leafy, but um, I'm, I'm kind of waiting for that one big lawsuit to kind of screw Keem over. I'm not a Keem fan. I'm really not. I mean, I saw the drama alert, but I, I watch it for the, the circus show, not the news. I watch Scares for News. But as always, guys, um, if you like my videos, do give them a like. If you'd like to see more great content, please do subscribe today. And as always, oh damn, keep on gaming, keep on having fun, and let's play. Oh,